Hello everyone, Sam is here from MyForestMagicWave.com um, making this a small video just to show the, you know, cover the recap of last week, uh, trades and setups and all that. Um, let's begin. This is uh, all the USD 5 minute chart uh, in my last webinar. I ex uh, explained how the all the USD is, was going up. I mean, all the yen and uh, pound yen, and all, you know, all those, a um, couple of those pairs were uh, in the fifth wave the upside and they accordingly uh, took the long setup here and uh, you can see this uh, trade on March the 11th the beginning of the week uh, I'm gonna make this video real quick so uh, the next one uh, let me show you this is uh, the next day uh, March the 12th you can see the euro USD I mean euro yen uh, a short entries uh, Nice one, one here, one here, all the way down. This was this produced 100 pips, this 120 pips. <coughs> this is the euro yen, yen pair. I mean, euro yen is amazing nowadays, pound yen as well. But you know, euro yen is just all crazy. Um, those small one are like um, all right. This is uh, the, the the next day, uh, the March the 13th. Uh, Euro USD, as I mentioned, that it was uh, coming down and it was very close uh, to touch the channel, the bottom channel TL. And I mentioned that we may dip a little bit to touch the ten, uh, channel TL and then bounce. So that's what the part of this uh, uh, part of that analysis, this entry, <clears throat> nice one to the downside, short entry. Excuse me, I'm having hiccups. And then this one, the next day on the 14, Euro USD start bouncing and going to the upside. The, it, right here, it was the channel line hit. Okay, um, channel was uh, on a daily chart. If you can see and find it. Okay, and the next day, also the continuation. This was the first entry from the bounce, from the channel bounce, went up, and the next day again, same story, boom. You know, that the first one on a five minute chart, the second one they got out. Even on a one minute chart, you have a nice entry, but I'm showing you on a 15 minute chart, beautiful entry. Your USD. <coughs> um, let me see. This was, um, okay, this chart I sent out in <coughs> to all my subscribers a uh, long time ago that is going to be bouncing from the channel and horizontal support. I look for the upside and look what happened uh, from there. It already bounced. Pound already bounced, but I forgot to send out the chart. Sorry. <coughs> okay, uh, <coughs> USD franc. Uh, in my webinar, I showed the chart. <coughs> um, it was making a beautiful head and shoulder on a daily chart. And I was expecting a down move from there, rejection from the trend line. There was a trend line and uh, horizontal uh, at the high of the left shoulder. Okay, so it's very nice and beautifully dropped from there and uh, you know, gave me this entry, nice and clean. And uh, maybe there are some more or not, I don't know. Uh, this is it, this is, uh, this, is, this is all there is. But uh, plenty of pips in these uh, small trades, right? And uh, let me show you something on a, like um, USDX. This was the chart I sent out, it's just still in tag, it went up, um, but uh, this, let me show you the USDX. <coughs> okay, this is the chart that I sent out a long time ago. I made it uh, March the 1st that we are going up to hit this sloping trend line. And then, you know, when we turn, hit the trend line, we drop. Euro USD going up means getting stronger and coming down means getting weaker. So if we were going up, we had another week to go, like the distance, you can see the small candy like this. We have a room there for a whole week. So that's exactly what it did. Uh, we had another week to the upside, hit the TL, and then boom, drop from there. This is the chart following after two weeks. You can see this March 15th. We went up one more week, hit the TL, drop from there last week beautifully. And that drop was as, as what I was anticipating, and uh, we trade accordingly. All those, uh, you see that my <coughs> Euro USD going up and going down based on this easy and uh, I don't have a euro um, chart here your index chart but that was also confirming 
uh, this uh, these trades. So you know, very very nice trades. Uh, uh, USD franc. I was talking about the daily head and shoulder. This was the daily head and shoulder. See the channel here, and the high of the left shoulder, nice and clean. And right after that, that's what happens. And it is going to be keep doing. You know, we coming down, right? So you know, you have a long way to go. <coughs> So if this one is a mirrored pair of your USD, so if this one is going down, your USD going up. Uh, I'm not going to show the rest of the charts here. <laughs> okay, so if you want to learn all these uh, analysis before charts and after charts like this one, this one a before chart I sent out to my, all my subscribers. And based on that, you can have a nice entries and nice trades. Okay. So if you uh, want to learn, join me. See all these here. You can see this um, this chart. You know, it's uh, Euro USD daily bouncing, and it bounced already. Pound yen bouncing and bounced already based on Elliott wave uh, channels, Elliott wave support resistance, harmonic patterns. I teach everything, and I teach real good. Uh, if you want to see, see and watch my uh, other videos down there on YouTube. Okay, and if you're really uh, serious about trading forex and need to learn, come join me. Uh, go on my website and you'll see the <coughs> button there, subscribe. Okay, thanks for watching, have a great day.